for the best medical and paramedical lectures subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to stay connected with us hey guys welcome back to this channel today i'm gonna give you a small review about radiation therapy so let's get started okay i believe you all know about radiation isn't it actually it is a rays which passes through the body either used for a diagnostic purpose or therapeutic purpose so have you ever thought how radiation can be used for diagnostic purpose as well as therapeutic purpose here is the answer when a high dose of radiation is used to kill cancer cells and shrink tumors it is used as a therapeutic purpose when a low dose of radiation is used as an x-ray to see inside your body that is used as a diagnostic purpose and as an example you can take x-ray of your broken bones then what is radiation therapy radiation therapy or radiotherapy often abbreviated as rt rtx or xrt it is a therapy using ionizing radiation generally used as a part of cancer treatment to control or kill malignant cells and normally delivered by a linear accelerator how radiation therapy is given it is given in two ways number one is external radiation therapy number two is internal radiation therapy now first we have a look on external radiation therapy it is a machine which is large in size and noisy too it does not touch you but can move around you sending radiation to your body from many directions it is a local treatment that radiation treats a specific part of your body how often external beam radiation therapy is given it is given in three ways here as mentioned number 1 accelerated fractionation number 2 hyperfractionation number 3 hypofractionation let them have a look one by one number 1 accelerated fractionation the treatment which is given in larger quantity daily or weekly doses to reduce the number of weeks number 2 hyperfractionation the treatment which is given in small doses of radiation more than once a day number 3 hypofractionation the treatment which is given in larger doses of radiation once a day to reduce the number of treatment let's have a look for another type of radiation therapy that is internal radiation therapy it is a source of radiation which is put it inside your body it is one form of internal radiation therapy called as brachytherapy so here is mentioned brachytherapy actually what it is it is a solid radiation source such as seeds ribbons or capsule which is placed inside your body using a catheter line internal radiation therapy can also be used in the form of liquid given through iv line what does radiation therapy do to the cancer cells number 1 it will kill or slows the growth of the cancer cells number 2 it will treat the cancer and number 3 it will reduce the symptoms by treating the pain actually what happens now when cure is not possible for the cancer radiation may be used to treat the pain and other problems caused by cancer cells or tumors what happens when radiation therapy is over number 1 follow up care for the whole life yes the patient have to be follow up care prescribed by the doctor for the whole life 
नंबर टू ये डॉक्टर्स और नर्स विल एग्जामिन यू ऑर्डर फॉर द लैब एंड इमेजिनिंग टेस्ट दे विल गिव एक्सरेज सी टी एम आर आई एज वेल एज पी ई डी स्कैंस डिस्कस ट्रीटमेंट अबाउट एक्स्ट्रा रेडिएशन कीमोथेरापी और अदर टाइप्स ऑफ ट्रीटमेंट Here are some mentioned below the latest symptoms. Let's have a look. Number one, the pain that does not go. Number two, new lumps, bumps, swellings, rashes, bruises, or bleeding. Number three, appetite changes, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, or constipation. Number four, weight loss. Number five, fever and hoarseness. What will be the side effects of radiation therapy? Number 1 diarrhea. Number 2 nausea and vomiting. Number 3 sexual changes. Number 4 swelling. Number 5 hair loss. Number 6 trouble swallowing. Number 7 mouth problems. Number 8 bladder changes. Thank you. That's all about today's topic. We will see you in the next video. do like leave a comment and share with your friends